The king's in the bailey. You better head over there. Got it. Did we really need that cutscene for that? I feel like that's slightly unnecessary. Just saying. Things are blown up here. Handle this many? Well, it might be tough if one more shows up. Hmm. Then that'll have to be the one I take care of. What? You're fighting too? <laughs> I understand that you've been looking for me. Yeah. Once I get rid of you, the darkness will go away. Can you do it? That darkness comes from your own dark memories. Do you think you can erase your past? Shut up! Face it. You turn your back on the present and live in the past. Because the light of the present is too much. You don't know me! Cloud! <sighs> I know. Because... I am you. Leon, everybody, hang in there. I forgot about an extra cut added cutscene in Final Mix, which we're going to see in a minute. So no way in hell I'm doing all of this in uh, <laughs> in this one episode. But yeah, there's going to be a cutscene now, and then there's going to be another cutscene, and then there's a boss fight, and then we probably end up this episode. Okay, fellas, you've got to go find Riku and Kairi. But Leon and the others are friends too. Don't worry, there's already lots of help here. We'll take care of this fight. But I promised Leon. Donald, Goofy, take Sora and get going. Riku, Kairi, 
Give me a little time, okay? Your Majesty! We understand. We'll go search for Riku and Kairi. Right. Watch for danger. You'll be careful, too. Wait, you guys. Strawa, do as you're told. You're coming with us whether you want to or not. Come on, Strawa. You gotta be good. Gotcha. Well then, skedaddle! Let's go! Whoa! I'm sorry, Your Majesty. Oh. Hope you can forgive us. Master Ansem, regarding the experiment I presented the other day, with your permission, I'd like to proceed. I forbid it! Forget this talk of doors and the heart of all worlds. That place must not be defiled. But Master Ansem, I've been thinking... They are not. Those thoughts are best forgotten. It has been far too long, friend.
some foreshadowing for Kingdom Hearts Built by Sleep and more cutscenes. Zaxion! Zaxion! Right here. What is it? Where is Lord Xemnas? His usual spot? The Chamber of Repose? Yes. Go and see for yourself. That isn't funny! I suppose I have no choice but to wait. But the clock is ticking. Time is running out. What to do? Why is he never around when I need him? It's almost as if he knows I'm looking for him. You know, I don't like that place either. What about you, Zexion? What do you think? I think eavesdropping is intrusive. Why are you even here? You and Zaldin were tasked to recruit new members. Have you forgotten, or were you procrastinating? As if. I'm doing my job. I'll have you know, I found one just yesterday. Mar something. That puts the organization's count at 11. And since I've been working so hard, I had Lexius take my place for the day. I want to rest up for tomorrow, so I can wake up feeling nice and refreshed. Is that so? Well then, I will leave you to it. I have work to catch up on. Good day. Now don't be like that. Come on, stay and talk. Isn't it time you told me about Xemnas's secret? How long ago was it? When a bunch of warriors wielding key-shaped swords appeared and unleashed a spectacular battle. And when it was all over, all that was left was a man lying unconscious without his memories. Xemnas. Yeah. I mean, Xehanort was found by Ansem right around then, wasn't he? Your point? The Chamber of Repose. If you recall, that's where we spent our time researching the darkness that resides within people's hearts. It's a graveyard that was sealed by order of Ansem the Wise. The first thing Xemnas did once he got rid of him was to undo the seal and build a room in the back. Ever since then, he holds himself up in that room when he can, and he talks to someone. But who? For all I know, he's the only one in that room. Need I repeat myself about eavesdropping? Not eavesdropping. Couldn't hear what they were saying. Dying to find out what it was, though. You wouldn't know anything about it, would you? I know I would very much like to focus on my own duties. As you should with yours, for we need to prepare the new facility immediately. But there are only eleven of us in the organization. We're going to need a few more hands on deck. What new facility? Oh, you mean Castle Oblivion. What does Xemnas plan on doing with that place, anyway? He already shared his intentions with us. But did you know there's something he didn't share? The Chamber of Repose is part of a pair. The Chamber of Waking is the other. Another graveyard, if you want to call it that. It was constructed by someone other than Xemnas himself. And that's where he'll find it. That's where he'll find his other friend. Yeah, that all and more in Kingdom Hearts Birth, but you know, Kingdom Hearts 3 actually to some extent. <laughs> Wow, this game has a lot of foreshadowing for very, very far into the future for when this game was released originally. Which I like.
<sighs> hey, you guys are looking lively. Scrab! Didn't we catch you messing around in the underworld? How'd a wimp like you get into Organization 13? <laughs> I bet you can't even fight. Yeah, but we can. You shouldn't judge anyone by appearance. Oh, I told them they were sending the wrong guy. Who is this kook? Remember, the organization's made up of nobodies. Right. No hearts. Oh, we do too have hearts. Don't be mad. You can't trick us! Silence, traitor. That line? Oh, we do too have hearts. Might be very important. <laughs> I'm gonna spoil and tell you why. But it might be very important indeed. Also, let's just, uh, let's just, I don't know, do I want to revert? I might be able to, no, I think I want to revert in a second. Yeah, I want to revert, because otherwise I'm not be, going to be able to do this. Wild Dance, uh, because Donald and Goofy can help me and I don't automatically do air combos, which is kind of annoying in this case. If you didn't pay attention uh, last time when we were doing this, or if you didn't watch that particular video, which is very possible, you have to get rid of all the waterfalls. But now we actually fight Damix after that, which that's his name, Damix. I don't know whether or not that was already clear to you guys. This is Damix, and he's kind of a wimp. Also, you can fuck him over big time with Fire Ra. When he's not invincible, that is. Let's... Come on, get you into the air. Oh, damn it. That's no good. I need to get him into uh, a combo, get him off the ground. God damn it, no. Alright, this boss fight is slightly more annoying than I remember. <laughs> and I remember it being pretty damn annoying, so... I'm going to have to cure in a second, which I I don't want. No, 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 no. All right, it's just 10 of them. Oh, this might be bad. This might be bad. This might be very bad. All right, I got him. I don't got him. I need to cure. I need to go into Valor ASAP. Maybe Wisdom, actually, for the water forms. Valor works better for Damix himself. If I get into Valor, he's dead. And I'm... Wow, I'm actually getting drive back very quickly. I might actually go into a limit for Sonic Blade. Sonic Blade is great. <laughs> what is it? Sonic Wraith, it's called now, I believe. Can you please stop attacking me? That'd be greatly appreciated if you could. Yeah, I'm gonna go into a limit to finish him off in a second. One hit. I need one. That's all I needed. One, two, three, four, five. That should do the trick. And Sonic Rave. You're dead. Good. I gained an armor slot and I gained a Blizzard upgrade. And now we get a cutscene. A long cutscene. And then we finally end of this episode. Maybe not actually, depends on how long the cutscene is.